Hello everyone, welcome to this video. Uh, today we will try to learn about how we create and delete junction link on Windows machine. And there are different use cases for junction links. We can use them for backup strategies or moving user files and there are different other use cases as well. So we will go into the video and try to create a junction link. So in order to create a junction link, I will first go and uh, in C drive in users in public i'll just create a random folder and i'll call it symlinks and usually junction links are created between two different drives as i don't have another drive i'll just use a c and, and the two different folders in the c drive itself so this is a dvd drive i can't i can't do that so i will I have created the symlinks and i will map c peter and here i'll map one folder onto the uh, symlinks folder in the public so for that i'll go to the command prompt make sure you open the command prompt in uh, as an administrator so once you open the command prompt you can use mk lin okay make link slash j and which two drives you want to map i want to map c users peter and random some random um, folder on c users pub public and simply and this is as simple as that and we have created a junction link so now if i go into random so it will be automatically created here so if i go into random and if i just create test file and i just open it this is a test file and save it so now if i go into public and in sim links if i see we will be able to see the same test file which is backed up here so we have successfully mapped two different folders in the same drive you can also do that for two different drives as well and this is as easy as that you know this is as easy as just creating it and in order for you to delete it we can simply use remove dir C sorry C users Peter and random. That's it. Thank you for watching.